recording this on Tuesday, Tuesday afternoon, September 29th, 2020. We're just out for a nice relaxing drive after school to check out some of the fall foliage. It doesn't feel like fall weather-wise. It's 77 degrees out today, if you can believe it. That's super warm. And we're all in the car today, even. So Ben has a spot in mind for us to get out of the car and appreciate some of the beautiful foliage here. And we thought we'd give you a quick little update on what the future holds for the channels during this little vlog. What do you say, Ben? Sure, why not? So number one, the vlog channel, we're planning to do, you know, we have to make our own Halloween this year, pretty much. Well, you know, we kind of do every year, but even more so this year. This is definitely a DIY, do-it-yourself, Halloween, wouldn't you say so? I would say so for sure. Definitely this year. So in October, look for Halloween themed vlogs. We'll probably do one like us carving pumpkins when we get closer to Halloween. We're gonna have the Dino Drag Halloween fun packs to unbox. We're gonna go to Target and do a little Halloween hunting. But I'm sure all the traditional Halloween things that we usually do, like trick or treating down Main Street and things like that, are probably mm -hmm. canceled. Canceled. But we are looking forward to October. We're still going to make the best of it. Mm -hmm. So we have pulled in here, and it is beautiful. I'm sh I think we've been here before for vlogs. I don't know. We may have. But you it, have a better memory than I do. But it definitely, it definitely looks beautiful. On the main channel, our classic Ben Stoibin channel, we are going to do the advent calendar, Christmas we tradition are. for year number eight. We are. You know, in an earlier update channel update video we were like nah, i don't think we'll do it blah, blah, blah. well we we got a we got some inspiration somebody really wants to do it we've even <laughs> practicing some voices that is that's one of the new characters spoiler alert <laughs> Yep, spoiler alert. <laughs> but that's way off in the future. And speaking yes. of way off in the future, yesterday, Disney D23 announced, much to our surprisement, is surprisement a word? If it isn't, it is now. <laughs> much to our surprisement, they announced that September 9th, 10th, and 11th of the year 2022 is going to be the date of the next D23 Expo. You know, traditionally it would have been on an odd number year, so, but 2021 has been tossed out the window and we just figured, you know, there's been no announcement to date. We just figured they're probably not going to do anything till 2023, which is also, you know, the 100th anniversary of Disney. Right. So, much to our surprisement, yesterday they announced September, there hasn't been a September Expo since the very first one in 2009. That's right. Mm -hmm. So fingers crossed that everybody's going to wear their masks up until then and we'll all all be out of this. So mm -hmm. fingers crossed. We'll see how well this vlog ages <laughs> we'll when, we, when we come back to this in 2022. And also, also before 2022, we're going to have a third member to our D23 party. Me, I'm going to be eight. <laughs> He's going to be eight and we've been promising... He would get to go to the next one. Yes. So it's going to be Tegan's first D23, whenever the next one is. Yeah, so being in September after Labor Day, I'm sure school will be in session, but after promising him this for years, <laughs> literally years, we can't just go, see ya, Tegan. <laughs> Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'm going with ya. I'm, sh I'm sure. <laughs> I'm I'm sure we he can get by with missing a Thursday, Friday, and Monday mm -hmm. in 2022, in like two years from now. So in third grade. Yeah. I mean, I think we could get him. I think we can teach him whatever he was gonna learn. All right. So enough enough looking at us. Let's look at this beautiful scenery. I am sure we've pulled in here before, but it is just beautiful outside today. Adventure, adventure, usually go out in the wild, there's like this pretty outside, usually. So what do you got down here? We got some wood, so because you never know when we need some wood. It's picking up some wood, just in case. So like, so like, 
I'm sure we've pulled in here before, but... It is just beautiful outside today. So beautiful. Adventure, adventure. You usually go out in the wild. It's like this pretty outside. Usually. how hot it is out when you're standing right here. You, you need, you need a, you need a sword or a pickaxe when, when you have a mine Oh, looks what? like they Yeah, it looks like somebody's some already making a wood pile over here. Let's take that. <laughs> We're gonna keep this as well. Oh, this is pretty good. <laughs> we could just use this. Building a mining hut wherever you are, huh? Somebody lost a shoe. Uh, now we know that it's not just safe to be here. I'm just going to put my wood back in the wood pile. I'll meet you guys. I think I... It's been too long since we've had one of these old school vlogs. <laughs> I know, it's been a long time. I miss getting out and about. Mm -hmm. It's so nice and calming and peaceful here. They may not be the most exciting videos, but nice to get some fresh air. And it, it's nice for them to see what Maine looks like, other than our house and a store. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's amazing. A Maine Target looks <laughs> and a Maine Walmart looks the same as a Idaho Walmart. Like I almost expect to see like a Bigfoot, like <laughs> oh, walk across. <laughs> yeah, like in the distance, and we go, "What's that?" Where'd Deegan go? <laughs> he went all the way back to his wood pile. He's all the way back towards the car. I'm expecting to hear our names in a minute with him realizing that we are not there.
Oh, I see him. Off in the distance. Do you guys see him? Yep. Oh, he's behind a tree. Where is he? Oh. I don't think he realized he went so far away, do you? There he is. <laughs> I'm coming! <laughs> I'm coming! Oh, gosh! Hey, I'm proud of you. You didn't wipe out. Good job, buddy. I was expecting a wipe out. We didn't get it on uh, video the other day, but uh, he wiped out on some acorns on the driveway and scunned his knee the other morning. But now, I'm a tree climber. <laughs> Hard to climb a tree with no branches <laughs> until you're way up there. And also on the main channel, we actually have a few more videos all lined up to go. It's very exciting. Usually Ben and I aren't this far ahead. Oh. <laughs> I think we're like three videos in the works for the main channel right now. Mm -hmm. Yay! So that's exciting. And if you haven't already listened, we know this is a very, th this is very limited appeal to the, <laughs> the vlog viewers. But Ben and I have a podcast where we talk about our favorite Christmas movie of all time, 1985 Santa Claus the Movie. It's called Santa by the Minute. And we talk about one minute of the 1985 movie every single week. We've uh, started this at the beginning of lockdown and quarantine. We're now like 31 episodes in, mm -hmm. or recorded anyway. I think by the time this vlog's online, I think probably we have 27 episodes online. Mm -hmm. We're lining up some special guest stars from other Christmas podcasts. Ben's been making friends with all <laughs> sorts of Christmas podcasters. Yeah, it's kind of fun. It's like a little Christmas community, and you talk about Christmas all year round. Christmas club. Yeah. Ours is the only podcast where you talk about a movie minute by minute. Yeah, we're we're a we're, little we're outside. Unique. We're kind <laughs> of like in the middle of the of the podcast group. You know, we're not one hundred percent like Christmas podcasters, and so we're kind of like, we're like movie by the minute podcasters. But our movie is it's so obscure that we're not like high appeal in the movie by minute genre either. We're kind of like in the middle. And it's kind of fun here. And if and, and we know it may not be everybody's uh, no. cup of tea. It is a 35-year-old movie. Yeah. And we get really nerdy and we do. It, it, it's definitely for a very it's very uh, an acquired taste. It is. And so is the movie. If you want to watch it for free in the <laughs> USA, if you go to Crackle, Crackle is a thing that exists. <laughs> and you can watch Santa Claus the movie there for free. Mm -hmm. If you don't mind the occasional advertising break. Right. Small price to pay. <laughs> yeah. And and also also our show comes online every Wednesday and every episode you can listen to for free. Perfect timing. <laughs> a plus. <laughs> Getting us into the fall spirit. <laughs> I know it looks so nice out here. I definitely can't guarantee a daily Halloween or October vlog like we have in years past. Right. But I can definitely guarantee more content here on the vlog channel very soon. Mm -hmm. We are in a forest, a national forest. We're actually heading to a little tiny lake that's very pretty in the fall. And I am 90% sure I'm on the right road. <laughs> yeah, because there's two roads. One leads to a house and one leads to the lake Mama was talking about. Yeah. Which way do we go? That way or that way? Or that way? We don't know. The road Let's is so narrow. Next, time, <laughs> next summer of finding clues and how to get out of the forest and stuff. Coming next summer. I went the right way! Yay! <laughs> 
<laughs> and check out that view. I don't know if the camera does it justice or not. And also try not to keep walking as I look to the uh, viewfinder and step into the lake. Don't step in the water. Don't get your shoes wet. Whoa, there's some pretty pebbles. Mm -hmm. You can pick up a pebble. Let's see how I can zoom. There's an ant on that one. And maybe a bug, I don't know. There's a bug all around this way. Oh my god. Oh, here's for you. This one's for you. Could take the sweet seaweed off. Oh, thank you. And here's for you, Daddy. And here's for me. Nice, some soggy rock. I wonder how far I can throw it. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wah, wah. Give me another one. I want to try it again. Okay, I okay, before over. I start wandering around. I want to do over. Yeah. Oh, no, give me one that I can throw. I want one that I can throw. Okay, that's better. Here? <laughs> Hang on, I got it. Oh, I dropped mine. Okay, that was much better. Thank you. <laughs> mine didn't go that far because I'm holding the camera with my right hand. Yeah, you were throwing it with your left, other left hand. Left isn't my throwing arm. Look at this. Look, somebody left a, lost a mud flap here. Or is this a floor mat? No, so, that's a mud flap. So we've seen an abandoned shoe and an abandoned mud flap. So somebody around here is going around shoeless and flapless. Yeah, shoeless and flapless. So let's take a walk over here real quick, see what's going on. This was a very relaxing little drive. Mm -hmm. It wasn't any epic adventure, but in 2020... Any adventure is epic. That is that is a very good point. <laughs> this lake is like wait, Lake Waka Waka. It's not really a lake. Wait. What is Lake Waka Waka? Pac-Man Lake. <laughs> it's because... It is. Isn't it the lake from Bunked on uh, Disney Channel? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we were heading out of here and we saw a huge bird swoop over the road. He's up in the tree. Let's see if I don't know if he's gonna show up on camera. Oh, there he goes. Oh, I don't know if he showed up on camera. But man, that was one big bird. He had an impressive wingspan. Mm -hmm. I think it was a hawk. I think. Yeah, that was a pretty big bird. It was like this big. Of its wingspan. That was a pretty big wingspan. <laughs> That's all for today. Oh man.